What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Jeremy here back again with another fragrance video. Hope you guys are doing absolutely amazing, man. Hope you guys are in good health. And if you watch this channel, I know you are smelling all the change. Yes, sir. Uh, yes, sir. Uh, hope you guys are doing absolutely amazing, man. Hope you guys are in good health. As always, man, hope the family's good. Hope the bag is coming in. I hope you're carrying yourself as men and women of integrity, man. As always, y'all know how I got to give it up, man. I love you guys. I appreciate you guys for rocking out with me for another episode here on House of Colossus, man. If this is your first time here, this is what we do. We sit here, we have ourselves a good time discussing the art of fragrance. If that's something that you're interested in, man, feel free to hit that subscribe button as well as the notification bell. So you'll be notified anytime that I drop new content, man. It's an awesome place to be. Just look at me and my Colossus family down in the comment section, man, where we get it in and we put each other on bangers, on top of bangers, on top of bangers. Yes, on top of bangers for sure. But... As always, y'all ain't come up to take up too much of y'all time. Y'all know what today is. You already know what today is. Today is Tuesday. What that is, what that means. You are tuned into another episode of Middle Eastern Tuesday. Yes, sir. Middle Eastern Tuesday, y'all. We back one more time with a beautiful fragrance, man, I got for y'all today. I think you guys will absolutely love. Definitely check it out, man. Especially for the season that we're in now, man. Spring. Um, This is really good stuff. Longevity on this pretty good. Last and Power is really good. Siage is good. Unisex. So this is definitely a his and hers type of fragrance, man. Definitely something you should check out. Today, y'all, we're going to be talking about from the house of Mason Alhambra. This one being Philos Centro. Philos Centro. This is the box. It's a purple box. Purple being my favorite color. This has like a white plaque on it. It is, um, you can actually feel. So it is texturized. Really, really nice box, man. Simplistic. And this is supposed to be a dupe of, I believe, Zerzhov Suspiro. Never smelled the original, so I got to put that out there for sure. You got your authenticity sticker on the back says Philos. This is some ingredient information. This is a, let me see if I can get that to come through. Auto Pop Farm Concentration, y'all. 100 ml bottle. I purchased my bottle off of fragbar.com. This is actually a, a, what's the name, based out of Canada, I believe, but they were really, really fast. Shipping was really good. This is still all readily available on that site right now for $29.95. It's on sale, so definitely something you guys should pick up if, you, if you're thinking about it once I continue to, you know, let you know a little bit about it. So I got a fairly new bottle, man. My bottle was manufactured in September of 2022, so fairly new. Got some information on the bottom. There's your batch barcode, QR code, the whole shebang, shawap. Hopefully I get that to come through. If not, we're gonna move on to the next. But nonetheless, man, just a really nice presentation, yes, especially for the price point. And I'll show you guys the bottle, which I really, really like, man. The bottle's really nice. This is the bottle in this deep purple color. Got a gold plaque on there. This is plastic. Really, really nice. Has like this velvety type of feel to it. Little, little sticker on the bottom, which is the Mason Alhambra printed sticker. The cap is metal. Metal cap, probably some plastic with it too, but this is definitely, this is heavy. And then you already know we gotta get into that distribution. Hmm. Hold on. Hold on now. You know I gotta do it. Pressurized. Pressurized. Ah, oh, man. So on initial, let me go ahead and hit my skin with this one more time. Doot, 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 doot. All right, so on initial spray, y'all, it is a little bit alcoholic. I have worn this about three, four times, but that initial open is still the same, man. A little bit of alcohol, but that 
dissipates very fast. Then you're hit with like this blast of like lemon or bergamot, like this sharp citrusy combo. As this fragrance continues to transition, there's some muskiness, like some, some muskiness that comes out, powdery. It does have a tinge of sweetness. It's basically a woody fragrance. Woody, I would classify this as woody, musky, powdery with some citrus undertones, like citrus-like undertones, me, mainly to me like a lemon and bergamot type of combo. It does last throughout the duration of the fragrance, man. It's not a super loud projecting fragrance. It's a very aromatic fragrance where it's going to just basically push off the air. So if it's wind that's coming off in wherever you live and you got this sprayed on, that wind catches hold of it and that sillage, sillage on this is really, really good because it being more so an aromatic uh, scent. I really, really enjoy this, man. This smells like spring as well. This smells like, it does have kind of like a floral component to it as well, more so white florals even though it's not listed in the note breakdown. But for me personally, if I had to classify this, man, I would say woody, powdery, musky, with like some citrus undertones and aromatic. I really, really enjoy this, man. I think this will smell absolutely amazing on a woman, especially if she got herself, you know, you know, suited and booted, you know, and she add this as, you know, the icing on the cake is what I'm gonna say. I think she'll smell absolutely amazing, but for me as a man, me wearing this, I felt confident wearing it. I didn't feel out of place. I felt good wearing it. I felt light, I felt clean, I felt airy. And <laughs> I felt airy. Anyways, I felt I felt good wearing it, man. I think you guys should definitely pick it up, especially if it's still readily available. I will link this down in the description box on Frag Bar. Hopefully it's still there for that $29.95. As of this video, it was there. Um, you also can find it on places like eBay, you know what I'm saying, uh, Triple Traders I believe has it as well, so definitely check it out, man. If you're looking for a, if you're into, if you're trying to add to your spring collection, you're trying to get something just a little bit more high quality, a little bit more nice, a little bit more refined, or, or if you're looking for a his and hers type of joint, this will definitely do it for you, man. I really, really enjoy it. Shout out to my uh, Colossus family member, um, Joel. He was the first one to put me on uh, Frag Bar. I ain't looked back since, man. This is a really, really nice purchase, man. I really, really enjoy it, and I think you guys will too. If you have Philo Syndro in your collection, y'all, obviously let me know what your experience has been, as well as if you have the original Zerzhoff Suspiro. If you have that in your collection, let me know. Um, Am I tripping? What what is what y'all you know? What's your experience with it, man? I really enjoy it. Something that's definitely gonna be getting a lot of burn for real, for real. I love it down from the presentation as well as pricing wise, man. Again, y'all, that is Philo Centro here on Middle Eastern Tuesday, y'all. My name is Jeremy. You are tuned into the House of Colossus. Don't forget to tell a friend, to tell a friend, to tell a friend, and to have that friend. To tell a friend about my videos, y'all. Until we meet again, much love from your boy. Y'all be safe. I love y'all, and I'll catch y'all in the next one. Peace.